My name is Donatas and today I'm going to show you our new module which is called Advanced Related Products. We, we already created uh, one module which is called Related Products. It's quite popular so we decided to create some advanced module which is called Advanced Related Products and it has more advanced features. Okay, here we have fresh PrestaShop installation. I have already installed advanced related products module just to be quick in this screencast so we can go directly to modules area click on other modules click configure and here we can see the first page of our module which is called manage related products well we're going to settings area first because we must understand how products actually are related and here we can see three main parts settings, simple layout options and table layout options okay let's get started with the first one which, which is called connect products and this is uh, two ways you can relate your products two options you can do it manually by selecting products and uh, later adding some related products or you can do it automatically by using product tags uh, and of course you can relate some more products manually also. I think that many of you knows what are product tags but I will show for other people who maybe don't know it. So let's go to the catalog. Choose some product for example iPod Nano. Info tab. Scroll down and here you can see tags field and here you can enter your new tags for example so the products which have the same uh, tags they are automatically related if you choose automatical way of relating your products so let's go back to the settings area and I think that this part is quite clear and today we're going to use this way of relating uh, products manually because it's more interesting uh, you can do more stuff than automatically relating by using tags okay let's go to the next option which is called max related products and here you can limit the related products which will be shown in product description page well, this limit is useful because sometimes you may have lots of related products, especially if you choose to relate to products automatically. So it's better to enter some limits, otherwise your customers may get confused while seeing lots of related products. So it's a good practice just to have some limits here. Okay, next option is called layout and here you can select one way of uh, showing your related product simple way or in a table well actually if you choose simple way your products will be shown in a grid if you choose table your related products will be shown in a table okay and one more thing just here we must choose manually because we're working manually here today and let's choose table here because this feature is more powerful and have some interesting features and next option is position here you can select the position your related products will be shown in for example product footer left column or right column and there is one very important thing here if you choose table layout here then you must choose product footer here if you choose table layout here and left or right column position here then your related products will not appear in your web store because it's impossible to show white tables in left or right column so let's choose product footer and next option is table layout option so if we, if we selected uh, table layout we can change these options I will remove all ones and let's click here and here we can see all the options which are available available to us so I just want to add some columns for example I think that the first column should be image 
product image, the next product title, or it's called name here. Okay, let's enter something more. For example, price, tax included, add to cart button, and I think just this is fine for me. Of course, you can select more options, uh, but mainly these uh, additional options are just product features. Many of you know what are product features, but I also show for others what actually are they and how are they managed. Okay, don't forget to update our settings. And let's go to the product features. Just click catalog and here you can see product features. Here you can see all your feature product features and you can add some more product features. And if you add more product features, they instantly become available here. So I think this is enough with settings area. We can go to manage related products area and here we can see select product part and here you can select your product you want to work with. For example we will select some iPod, iPod Nano and here we can see that iPod Nano is selected now and we can start working with, the, with it. It doesn't have any related products yet, so let's find some products to relate. Uh, here we can see connect with or relate with. Let's expand category 3, choose accessories. Okay, I just want to relate with this one, for example, maybe MacBook. Okay, we have two related products. If we want to relate and work with other product, then we can select another product by clicking this button. All the related products are already saved, so you don't have to press any other button just to be sure that everything is saved. Just click select another product and you can select, for example, some laptop, MacBook here, and work with, with it. Add some more related products to this product. Okay, I think that it's quite clear in this part. Let's go to the front office and let's see how related products are displayed here. Let's go to home page. Select iPod Nano. And here we can see our related products. You can change the amount you want to add to cart here, for example. You can see image, product name, price, and add to cart button. Let's add some to our shopping cart. Okay, we can see that iPod Nano is right there. Actually, this shopping cart is old because I, I have already added some products but it's it's okay for now I think it's quite clear that I, I have added some products here okay let's go to the, to the back office and settings area and here we can select simple layout just to see how products are displayed in the grid let's update settings go to iPod Nano and here we can see related products are shown in a grid. Actually, title is missing here, like related products, but uh, we will add it soon here, so no problems with this, I think. Okay, next option, let it be left column, update, and refresh our page. Okay, here, we, here they are, related products are here, of course, well, mm, title is missing, but we are going to add some title here. I think that's it for today, I hope you enjoyed the screencast, sorry for my English, it's not my native language, but I believe it will, it will, will improve with the time, bye.